morning guys, good great morning to all these tuning into the Let's see how many other things possible as well on this curable stay. You know my deck. That deck is left. We just didn't check out the um, I just didn't get an assessment of rising sun and moon. you need, she will message me and I will okay. Yeah. yeah, so I am in West Coast Barbies and I've just left the Y'all hear it now? Hello. Hello. Hi, morning. Morning. Um, the video on the, the live is not clearly. It's not clear? It's not clear. It's not clean clear. It's only clear. Oh, mama. All right. Let me see what's going on. Alright, let me see what's going on. So when clear with the video, right? Alright, let me see what's going on. So when clear with the video, right? Turn down the adjuna, man. Front clear, everything clear. We ain't got no problem here. Probably the phone just had to pick up right here, man. No data area signal and anything. So this is. Right, this is the race course then by setting up. This is Rising Sun race course. And I ain't going in there. So them banners doing a parking lot inside. They got massive construction going on there. Right now, they carry me in and they show me everything. So they've got massive construction going on there. 
and this place is going to be ready to take on 15 20 thousand people because there's going to be a big show yeah they're going to be a big show and all right so this is washington we going into and this is the closest I can get to any Washington guys. They may give me American visa. Now, my head says we got diffused the tensions in Guyana. And history has shown, right? I don't know if it's, it's the, legal, the level of ignorance that's be heightened or it is a time period where illiteracy as it's is at its highest but let me tell you a story that i experienced i know about in a past time we had a little tensity in the country and thing going on and some black youths villagers of beirut right i think it's beirut if i i um i could be corrected if y'all know otherwise so what happened they see an old indian lady walking through the community somebody in the height of the ignorance run and go and hold the lady's an old leg like, an old indian lady like she fine fine and they run and gone and put some licking in the old lady now the lady dead well when you beat an old leg there's normally be a ball of fire and when you beat the old leg, the old leg just disappear. You understand? But when they beat this old leg, the old leg didn't disappear. The old leg left right there. And the police come and pick up the old leg. And the doctor check the old leg and says a human being. And check the pulse and says dead. And the autopsy said the old leg was murdered. Right? And about four of them get charged. But think that they're in jail and to know. For the stupidness. Now what I'm saying. Yeah, she dead. She dead. The old like dead. What am I call old like? Now what I'm saying, because of the tensity in this contract where they're running around, I just had the experience coming. Driving coming, I just had the experience with the ignorance. Y'all gotta stop. Y'all need to cease and desist. Y'all nobody will like sorry. Y'all nobody will like. I, I tell you about. Years ago, you know, I tell you about when I was a little boy. I'm telling you about the other day. I'm telling you a few years ago. Me telling you when I was a little boy. Right? And the same thing was going on. was tensity in the country. I think it's either 2018. 16, 17, 18. Sometime around there. Who remembers the old like story? The old Indian lady that was beaten to death in Beirut. It's Beirut? Beirut is like the back of paradise. Uh, yeah, sure. Next yeah. to paradise, yeah. Next to paradise, right? Well, yeah, right inside there. Oh, like, oh, like, you're gonna beat the lady. And when the lady don't fall on, the lady didn't disappear or turn into a ball of fire and, and fly off. Yes, and she left right there. Right? No, we're talking because I got a story with a girl that claim people claim thief some cheer. Now, me ain't gonna talk on this story, you know why? I don't know what she was doing there. You understand? I don't know. First thing I asked him, he said, so the girl thief in chair with a car, right? But I know people thief goat with car. So, they don't know new thing. You understand? What is the girl doing there? How the girl know about this church? This young girl. Just go to a random church and 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 go into a community just so and you got when you catch somebody thiefing, you go to the police. Now let me show you something. Somebody talking about black if I say black people, I ain't saying nothing. I saying when there's tensity because it happens in Indian communities too. I'm saying the tensity in this country needs to be, be diffused. That is what I'm saying. I said it whether the tensity is between black or Indians. You understand? The tensity in this country needs to be diffused. That is what I'm saying. That is the fact. Now let me show you this video. 
This just happened. Then buys the NSK and I video in. Let me show you this video. What you going here? And I can, then I can tell you what's going on here. I'm gonna play it back again. So this fella, so I'm driving down the road. Let me put it in the context. Somebody asking why Drain is when is when always is dress dress up. Me driving on the road, and me see one car across the road. So me want for nobody car doing the middle of the road. Right? Me want for nobody car doing the middle of the road. It's a man, had some problem with a man. Indian man driving one car. And black guy driving another car. The black guy car across the road. Indian man, any car. Man must pull across him, but you don't know what happened. Right? And it's big cut black the road black half now. I drive him from me lane going up. He carried across the road. Right? I wanna show you all what he did on. I'm gonna delete some of these things, man. <laughs> So let me show you how he did across the road. He just the black and every road. Now I video and watch what he here we can tell me. Hey son. Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. You are gonna sign up and thing. Yeah, yeah. How much are the courses? For both of them, eh? And you gotta get a couple of dollars extra for take out your passport picture and do your application and so. Yeah. So I'm telling y'all. No. Me drinking water and minding my own business. Watch, he did cross the road when I start video. He doubt, he carried the cross the road. Come out one more time and I stand and then realize something going down. No. You done the in some kind of road rage bullshit. Me there watching you do your illegality. Me get up, me say nothing, you know. Me lock up, me care. You could imagine how hard he yalla. You are here. Right? Nalini Ramcharan, um, somebody on the man blasting you on TikTok, you're gay. Well, here, you go with, use, use follow people who say that you're waiting for here, like I said. Me not gay, but what me gonna do just for the fun of it, me gonna black you, leave you go with the gay crew. She waited for here, like I said. I got a, I got a, you know, this call me quick drama, girl. I just black shit for the fun of it. You understand? Because she there by he, she sees somebody on TikTok. You don't tell me what you see. Keep this story to yourself. Drink water and mind your own business. You hear? You hear? You hear is the black bastard? <laughs> just for the fun of it. Just look for one, one just for black. You understand? Even some good fans and they just black them. Just like them. When they look forward to something, they marry you, so bland. Cut it out. You understand? You believe like I did for Molly. <laughs> she hears some man talking for me that I get. She waited for here why I can say. Well, why here why I got I can say nothing. I like doing something. I block you. You gonna follow he. You understand? You gonna follow he. Yes, so I'm telling y'all. Now the tensity is real. You understand? She wants the session, she get it. It's a session looking for. Big excitement and then next blam your driver what? Is I getting critiques? What happened? What happened? You get black. <laughs> Just so. Yes, sir. So some guy get catch even some cheer. 
right? And next April beating she, and got she put hole in she, but she head, and tying she belly. <laughs> you ever hear anything like that? You ever hear anything like that? Any other part of the world? You ever see them kind of ignorance though? Call the police. When there's a thief, you call the police. That is what you do. You understand? You not get yourself involved in stupidness. First thing is, I don't know what a girl thief. Me getting in there, cause I see a lot of people. I I am assume, I'm I'm looking at people in the comments, and I realize a lot of them jumping out cause the girl is a good looking girl. Oh, and I mean, whether you're good looking or you're good looking, as cause I know some of the biggest rang tang them is them good looking one. Here they rob you blind without feelings. No feelings at all. They rob you. So I don't have no time with that. It's not them kind of banners watch your face. I don't have no time with them. You understand? Now I'm saying everybody. You didn't re make a report. If nobody made a report to the station that that girl was stealing, I want somebody to tell me what area was that. And everybody, the person who made the video and the rest of people who could be noticed in the video need to be locked up. All of them need to be in the lockup and charged. You understand? How she reached there? She thief in chair? I read she thief in chair. Call the police. Hello. Hello. I hear you. Hello? Yes, I'm listening to you. Good morning. I put it into that girl with the cheer story, right? Uh -huh. That girl was trying to give an explanation. Nobody listened to that girl, right? The police need to be involved in this matter. You hear me now? I'm hearing you loud and clear. Yeah, that girl never had an opportunity to explain herself. She was trying to explain herself. My brother, my brother, let me go it over for you. Because it seems you little ill-informed too. She does not have to explain herself. If I meet you and I suspect that you're a thief, I call the police. You're not an investigator. You understand me? You listen to me? Hello? Even in you trying to interrogate her, you're not police. Then I you walk. Right away, somebody can you catch them or wherever you apprehend them. You call it apprehend or you make a citizen's arrest. Right? The laws allow for that. Me go, listen to the program, man. I'm going to address you your thing there. He like you doing babysitting and so. Yeah, brother. So here me tell you. Like he saying they, they ain't get your chance. No, no, no. They don't need to give her no chance to explain. She needs not explain it. I catch you thiefing. Mom, hold on. Don't move this car for me. Or in, in that case, you look at what's the situation. You're driving the car. You take the keys for the car. You understand? Call the police. The stolen claiming of stolen chairs are in the car. All of this is evidence. They're contaminating a crime scene. She can't come and say, no, it wasn't me thief in the chairs because the police came and they photographed chairs in her car. Call the fudging police. You understand? It's not you walk. So what you're doing, who say what say? That is how they get themselves in that problem. Because nobody wants to hear what they had their own plan. They had their own plan. And I'm saying the tensions are high in this country. Religious leaders and everybody else have to start coming out and wind it down. These quick fixes, government running for God, Gida, Gida, Gida. We got to deal with the realities. 
We have to deal with the realities. We have to deal with fact. Call the fudging police. Your police The girl should say she get some injuries. All by the thief. I watch her carry the girl go. This girl go she alone with the other person there. She alone got thief in chair. Out of church. Which community is she going for do the for end up with a set of people wrong she hold up and she. She mad. Like she mad. She gotta be mad. You have a problem you encounter, you defuse it. That is the first thing you do. People looking for hot up this place and do something. Now this girl ain't resisting in no way. We ain't got no fight. Hey, girl, watch out, sit down, sit down here. Hold on, you sit down right here in this girl. Take out chair, put in chair per head, tie in belly, lock up all of them. Lock up all of them. Hello. Morning, morning, brother. How are you? Morning. All right, there is for things. When a girl with a chair, I don't think... Man, turn off the fudging song in the background, no man. You can't for hear your own voice. Oh, no, no, listen to me. The girl with the chair. Once you call Ethan, the Lord knows it best. I want to remind you of something. I saw the protesting box stand when the box student was protesting recently. I want to enlighten you of something. There was a Muslim woman who disguised herself, who were the first one to speak the same. That she was very happy to know that we have a Muslim leader and we will all go down well. But she cannot stand the Muslim community standing and not saying anything of the wrong words of this government. Now let me say this. She is with the Yolita Moore who they brought the election petition to court. She sat on a council with me. She was a former councillor. And in Islam, when you're greeting somebody, you know that. You deal with a lot of Muslims. No, but what's the context? What's the context of our... Hold up, hold up for me. What's the context of our conversation? What do you mean? You listening to my program this morning, what I'm talking about? <laughs> so what's the context of what you telling me there about? No, I'm trying to know if I'm trying to enlighten you about the protesting in, in Boxstar. No, me talking about protest. I am talking about diffusing the tensity. No, me interested in that this morning. I want to figure out how are you going to defuse the tensity in this country. That's why I'm talking about this morning. I don't care what you're talking about. I'm not interested. I am not interested. You understand what I'm telling you the first time? How are we diffusing? Use a smart boy. Your skull one one time well. How are we diffusing the tensity in this country? That you want to talk about. I don't want to hear what you want to talk about. You tell me about what you want to talk about this morning. All right, what we got to do is, as you said, get the religious leader together. We got to come out, we got to pray, and we got to ensure that this, 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 this cabal that is taking place in the country right now, that it needs to stop. And the only thing can put an end to that is the religious leader has to come out on the four corner, all the four corner, and preach and lecture the people so that we can bring peace and togetherness in this country. Roger that, my brother. That's why we're here. Thank you. This is a simple thing. This is a serious thing. We are having serious discussions here. This is a simple thing. You can't add in thing. You got a, a half barrel with gas. Some people run around like a match. A man come, he claiming he want help for out the, 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 the fire. He got aisle for true. When next one got carol for true. None of them even know what's the situation for defuse, how for defuse the situation. 
You understand? There needs to be a diffusing of the situation in this country. We need to be real. We need to be honest. We need to be genuine. You understand? And it starts with the leadership and then it trickles down to everybody. As we understand, we have a situation where there's an opposition that is losing its footing. It feels the only way that it can get back power is by creating instability in this country. They care not for people, but for power. You understand? All right, we are in that situation. We are a country of six races. Um, Indians and blacks being the predominant races. We are a country that has a, a history of us going, the Indians and the blacks going at each other's throats. These are facts that are listed. How do we deal? How do we move into the 21st century? A country that is now on the precipice of becoming very wealthy. How do we deal with that? We are also a country that seems to be ha having corruption ingrained in its politicians all over we not have a pnc politician a pbb politician it seems that corruption is ingrained in our politicians that is the reality we are a country that has a guyana a, a police force that continues to falter. How do we deal with that? These are the discussions we have to have. The facts are on the table. How do you deal with it? How do you address it? And you address it by looking at the facts, accepting the facts, accepting the fact that this is how it has to be addressed accepting who is wrong and who is right and then addressing the issues you understand me that is what has to be done I might not want to accept publicly certain things that wouldn't work well for me but if you notice if people tell me i come back changed i could remember when i started videoing doing lives i do everything right i video everything anybody broke up foot, crash up this like they're live for the thing and when i look at the effects i used to get high numbers from the people watching on but from time to time, I've met family members who were really daunted by the grueling appearances of their family dead and crushed on the road. And I realize in my quest to get viewership, I've been hurting people and what I do. I develop a method of commentary that allows me to death from a distance, not show the people, but explain to the people what I saw. So you ain't got to see the grueling, um, you know, disturbing images. You don't have to see that, and I've, I've tuned myself for that. We have to accept. You have a political party today, the op a political opposition that goes and explains to people, still talks about people. And when they were in government, they did the same thing, telling people how the 
government, the PPP government of the past used to kill black youths. But who was the who was the head of the Guyana police force? At the time, was a man named Mr. Felix. And when he came off as commissioner of police and the government changed, he became a minister of government. He was rewarded for his participation and heading up a police force that oversaw the killing of black youths. So how how do we how do how do you fathom this? I cannot comprehend. How does it work? How does opposition leaders continue still come? How can they come with a straight face? How do opposition leaders and opposition inciters? Have their children go to university and do well and come out and ask other people's children to carry the fight to risk their lives. Y'all know where y'all go, them protest. Like people asking in boxer, why are you being getting loan? Christopher Jones go and tell people in boxer that they ain't getting loan, black you ain't getting loan. But all them camera footage you doubt, you believe you could go and get a loan when you did looting a photograph come out with you looting in Monjapo? Who giving you a loan? Which bank? Who's giving you a loan? Look at the people, the 15 persons who are charged for riotous behavior. Look at the 15 persons who are charged for riotous behavior. You imagine they trying for God for said they want a loan? How you get in the partner? You tell me how you get in the loan. Which bank Giving rioters loan. Eh? They carry people out there for fight for which they, when they do fight done. When they fight done and all the dust settles. Eh? The government could do for you. The government could go into Buxton and give them anything they want every time. Do you know? A senior bank manager called me and said, critic financing doesn't work like how you talking. Financing don't work like how you talking. Because people watching, I like air like if you're gonna give financing, they would give 25% of your profit um, property. The value of your property, they will loan you 25%. Other areas they'll loan you 50%. Some areas they'll loan you 75% because of the area. And these leaders continue to come and tell the people. Fight, let me fight, tell the people cheering for go there. For run and broke up people, thing and loot from people. And the police force and the government is a part of the problem. The police force and the government of Guyana is a part of the problem. Here, why? Do you know? That there's camera footage of the looks like now how they go and coming down. People say, but they set up. Who set up them? Anybody could lead PPP support, PNC supporters. You just come and tell them anything and got them doing any kind of shit. The opposition leader come and said there were people inside the group. So I could come and tell somebody just so, call me go a thief. Come with your bicycle, we pick up people provision and carry them back in your house. Just says happen. Me, you know it's an easy buy. You imagine you critical if we go and jump somebody house tonight. How are you doing, buy? Eh? The opposition come and say how PPP got people inciting people and, and set it up. Eh? So PPP got people who just come in a group of people and tell them, let me go, let me go, thief, just so you could come and tell me, critically, we're gonna jump a house tonight. Me and no have a jump house, buddy. I don't know how to jump house. 
I got get some kind of training. You don't believe it's natural. People just running. Everybody know. Look how much people come and spoke out about that. Mothers, enough people in the black community felt embarrassed. And then the explanation is that somebody put them up to it. Somebody put you up to thief. You got tried there. Just the women that start making excuses about giving blow. Somebody put them up to it. Because this, the, this is the biggest thing going on in this country. Blow. Nobody taking responsibility for nothing. Yeah, I better get real, eh? You listen to opposition leader was telling you that no, it's the PPP running we party. He is accepting that the people are so gullible that anybody could come and tell them anything and got them doing anything. The opposition leader threw the people of Golden Grove under the bus by saying that they're so stupid, anybody could come and tell them Anything I got them doing anything. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Y'all understand what I tell you? It's not me. The opposition leader say it's the PPP set up this thing. Got the people of Golden Grove looting and pillaging people thing. Is that me, sir? Is the opposition leader, sir? You imagine though? He automatically saying. The people of Golden Grove so stupid. Anybody can get it for do anything. You just can't. Let me do it. Let me go. David Hines tried to explain the looting. <laughs> when you meet leaders like them though. You meet leaders that don't have anything. Can't show that they have anything in their personal life. They have nothing to show. They have not benefit anything personally. David Hines is an associate professor at a university in America. Ask see how much people he got scholarships for, how much black youths he helped. Even if he can't carry them from over here, how much black youths he helped in America. Yeah, be careful with the people where y'all following, buddy. I know what I'm telling you. Yeah, be careful with the people where y'all following. Yeah, get yourself in. Yeah, get yourself in problem. When the dust done set, like telling you, you go back. You go to the Arab uprising. You go back. You go and check and see. You know the PNC got professional protesters. The PNC. This one laughing at the back here. With the blood type of That me, you know. This one laughing at the back there. Them two is laughing. The PNC has professional protesters. If you go back from 1992, they got people get all day still protesting until today. This day walk. Yes, yeah, sir. That is their walk. And they ain't got nothing. They ain't got no house. They ain't got nothing. When the PNC, they're good. They don't say, all right, these will throw their belly for we. Let me help them. There's no loyalty in the PNC. They throw you under the bus. All they got to do is do right by the people. For Narton, come and say. For you come and say, it's a sad situation. And it was taken out of context. You understand? And we do not condole any kind of looting and so. He come out and say, and we would like to get the government to give back the vendors the drinks that was drunk out. <laughs> the police drank out the vendors' drinks. <laughs> he 
Imagine an egg ball lady. Right? An egg ball lady. Come and say, she needs that she, that lady. She needs such the lose three million dollar egg ball. You understand? And all the people, not in had good enough representation for said the what the people lose? They lose out drinks. Drank out the drinks. And it was it was properly pronounced. Drank out the drinks. The police drank out the people them drinks. The people and got the police running up and down. The police obviously thirsty. You understand? Who drinks your water? I drink, and it's you got me running up and down. If you invite me to your house, where water you want to go drink your water? Neighbor water? <laughs> you better open your fridge and give me something for cool down me quench me thirst. You understand? I kid you not. Something wrong with these people. Something wrong with these people. Well, they were telling you, nothing wrong with Norton. Them. Remember them man getting money? Alec Norton and Sherrod and them banner. Alec Sherrod knew he making money now. Sherrod said, put dollar, five dollar, ten dollar, anything. Put in a little bit of money. Yes, uh, support the cars. Sherrod looking for support for the cars. Them banner don't know. People like them thing, you know. People like you rile them up and inside them and think this, this. We politics is like is like young and the restless. Every day is a different episode. What are you doing? What are you, what are you, you get out to anybody even find out what's the facts? Yeah, yeah. Still home by the house. So who gonna take care of you up there? Who gonna take care of things? Yeah, Where say you still home by the house? Yeah, no, 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 no. Me answer, me say. So they come and pronounce him dead at home? Yeah. They need to carry him to the hospital. Okay, oh my mama. So we got death in the family. Um, um, Nigel lost his father this morning. So we got we are in the tongue and we are gonna see what will happen there. Yeah. Right? That man at this store up thing I tell people but send $5 for me, send $10, anything. You imagine when I'm all bored in my begging? <laughs> if you know them banning and no shit. Right? Imagine you purporting to be a politician that could get people somewhere and when you put into government if they give you governance if they put you in government you'll be able to run the country and you can't even run your own life you understand you begging <laughs> i kid you not hey man me not make up this thing them man a beg for the program for five dollar and ten dollar it's not me you know i used to get donations to I used to get donations too. But you gotta remember, I never tell y'all to vote for me. I never tell y'all I run this country. I never promise nothing. Yes, yeah, sir. I was just always a man in the street in the struggle. You understand? I was just always a man in the street. And you have people who sit and tell you what to do and what not to do and what is wrong and what is right in governance. And them no know. They can't even get money for themselves. They got big. <laughs> yeah, I try with them. I try with them. I ain't in that. This 
it's better you go and see all them beggar man on them corner and put them in parliament. Since it's beggar man, you are looking for. <laughs> you ever see anything like that? Guy needs a special kind of people, you know. You go in for choose something. Right? You are nice children. Here. <laughs> Don't let me tell you, they're going to hurt their feelings. Are you going to build a house? Are you bring a contractor? And he homeless? <laughs> he tell you how to build a house. How to build the best house. Yes, and, and the person who recommended the contractor said, Oh, he lives in my backyard, he's homeless. <laughs> or a doctor. You go to a doctor and he say, oh, I just kill a few people. Let's try and you see if it will work. <laughs> Those are going to people like share it down. God as well. Ah, we know how to manage money. We know how to do this. We know how to do that. We just had a test run in five years. We didn't make it, but give us a try again. And in the meantime, help me now, help me now. I beg you for help. You got anything help me? I've been in power for five years. We were in power for five years. You ain't got nothing, me ain't got nothing. You understand? But here, if you give me a chance again. Hey, son. Buy a clap one box of you, you know. I tell you already. Ninety seven, eighty nine, twenty four. You get it, Paul? Yeah, This thing is working. I think it takes too long. We'll send it back right away. Alright. As far as play, he, he thinks he's some big man. You're a critic. Send the code there. I clap one box in here just now. Watch, watch. You play big man. Sometimes I come in the house. And you might change it. Hey, we critic there. So you have one of those who come now says he. We critic there. But I clap a box in the band head so hard. He get migraine right to me. The Suku does not Western Union numbers like you know Western Union numbers, man. Western Union is not six. I can't remember what the numbers, but I know it's not six. The black Mr. Land. Yeah, I get black from so many things in my life. Yes, yeah, son. 24, 99, 93. Roger that. Huh? Eh? Uh. Yeah, so I'm telling y'all, imagine you go, <laughs> you go to the doctor, right? And everybody, when you walk in the room, everybody crying. What happened? Oh, the doctor just killed my daughter. Oh, the doctor just killed my son. Yeah, you going in there? So people like Sherrod Duncan and Aubrey Norton now. Telling people, oh, we've been in government for five years, but it wasn't enough for really do anything. And PPP, they're in government for two years now, and they do more than we do in five years, but the teeth in. <laughs> you imagine we get new highways. The whole country light up. Everybody building something. Yes, sir. Everybody building some house. 
Every village getting some road. Yes, and them have been here for five years. Nice, nice time. And they ain't get none for themselves. They ain't get none for nobody. Eh? Yeah, I gotta be joking. I ain't joking for laugh, joke for truth. <laughs> So give me the opportunity to run the country again. But in the meantime, help me, help me. I ain't no forget money for do this program. Are you trying with them, Ari Lal, boy? We all did feel they gonna make me something. I you try there? Christopher Jones knows about entrepreneurship. And when the government hold up he, when the BB come up hold up he, the barber chair is still in the house. He even come with the box yet. <laughs> he couldn't even get the business out of the ground. He could not even get the business off of the ground. You get a place, you get the chairs, you get everything, and he couldn't figure out how to put it together. No, he knew. Hypocrites? <laughs> the opposition is a party of hypocrites. Oh, we just call more than one hypocrites. Like how you got a flock of birds and them kind of thing, though. We just call a. A party of hypocrites, just the PNC. <laughs> a PNC of hypocrites. <laughs> a flock. Like you got pigs and cows and you know, ducks. <laughs> oh my. I don't know why they don't make me the Opposition leader, let us see real action. The PPP will start biting the nails. Hello, good morning. I hear you. Beautiful, beautiful, yes, yes. The girl is a very pushy girl, you know. The girl from boxing was Meg the Wine? No, no, but here, here, what now? Let me tell you something. Don't worry. Yeah. I know the, the vice president does a lot of work and he's, he's very outgoing and have been, you know, working hard to. There's push, there's politics. They promise the people this thing, you understand? And in tune, they're afforded a good life. But let me tell you, the girl from boxing, she is a pushy girl. She's a very progressive girl. The girl was make the wine, was make strokers wine. Right? Very progressive girl. With her, without the PVP, she didn't make it. You understand? With her, without the PVP, the Boxton girl is making it. The girl bad for this. Everywhere the girl is there. Yeah, want um, yeah, got money. Yeah, got money. Buy, um, I want puri and fish cake. And I want a cane juice. So just before Hope Bridge, got the best Korean fish cake. I want to in meeting. Yeah. Yeah, whether with or without. Don't worry about boxing. I left the boxing out of the outreach and all them things there. The girl would just make the wine from Boxton. Progressive girl. Aggressive progressive. Yes, yeah, a with or without. No, no, me still there for my diet. Me had breakfast for the morning. Those were gonna eat the puri and the thing and little cane juice and that's it for the morning. Me had breakfast. Those within me calories. Um I said divide the minister of sports long time. Me see. 
regular bike. Me and Minister Tag, they are dead. Um. I get a pepper on this thing? Nah, nah, just the sour. Good. Pepper. Yeah, 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 the place dark, 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 but the gray, gray. Yeah, yeah, me know the girl. Me know the girl. The girl starts her business and the AP, um, um, after 2015, the girl really, she want no time. They have some people, no matter what, here. That's the problem when you get yourself in politics, you gotta know. When things change, you prospects gonna change. If your business person stay neutral, you understand? Stay neutral. That girl from boxing was make the strokers wine, yeah, buy the wine. The guys, anyway, the guys see me, I said, man, I think about the girls that critic take a wine. You understand? But when I look at her, when I look at her confidence, when I look at the way she speaks, you understand? But, me and Kay, she is going to, watch a girl going to find she way at the airport. She winds in at the airport. And I see like she got daddy at the, at the, um, she winds going in at the building expo. Yes. People want to go and, you know, you're going to build in there, you're walking on a building expo. Why not have me in the building so you could pour a glass of wine? Why could showcase why going on? Yes, yeah, so what is going on? Girl is an aggressive girl. With or without any government, she can survive. I could tell you that. Running me, what's up, my good morning, Mr. Critic? I'm connecting you from Itabali Region 7. We would like to have a new cheer person. Hello, good morning. Morning, Critics. Critics, I said something there to you, man. See if you upload, man. I'm here, yes. I have a look at it, brother. What, my buddy? Hello, brother. Where's some tissue, buddy? Tissue? This is my dad, you know. Huh? He's a big man, a black guy, got his business here. No, that's not your dad, that's a worker. He's got young dad, he got his son, he's got the car, watch them, eh? Where the big man, eh, girl? Where the big man was there, okay? You there, eh? Okay, all right. You all right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Jesus Christ. Yes, this one's sweet boy. What you wearing? Any? Fish cake is wrapped it. Fish cake in the pori. Mm -hmm. So this is salt, you man. Or by me using enough salt. Anything in this thing here? Yeah? Okay. Oh shit! Hey, sorry, sorry, I forget you out of there. You think they're so nice? Like me, if you've attacked the yeah. <laughs> Straight up. Sorry, man. This is the banner. As soon as you come over the whole bridge, 
You had it marked down. On the right hand side, you can't miss it, Mark. Wash bay. And you see a little snack out there. Fresh cane juice, juice and a squeeze right there. Ah. Huh. Egg bar, I don't know. I want extra sweet by This is the first time I ever take the water in my cane juice. Mm. This is the second time I forget them they'll pay. There we go. Who will that watch? Me want me here. The thing tastes so nice. Yeah, I'll take care of talk later. Me wanna talk them all. Me wanna study them people on shippiness. The thing tastes so nice, I just wanna digest me food. And enjoy this moment. Yeah, I'll take you later.